everyone, this is Jody Gray with Zach and Jody Photography, and this is the second video in managing our business finances, where we are going to cover the first step on how we deal with, ha with having a irregular income, something that is not consistent and doesn't come in at the same amount every single month. In the first video, we shared our stories, our financial stories of where we started out when we first got married to where we are today. And we talked about budgeting and how to budget, which is the foundation of getting your finances in order. When we have a plan for our money, we notice our money actually starts working for us, which is a good thing. But it can be hard because we have an irregular income. So the first step in handling an irregular income is actually knowing the months that our money is coming in, which is a good thing. So what we do is we keep track on a chart the money that we have coming in for the year. So I have an Excel sheet that I created and whenever we get a retainer coming in, I write um, down on that month that that payment is coming in, um, I write the amount down and then when I know that we're going to get the final payment, say that's October, so then I write down that amount in October. Um, and so make sure that you only put money that you know that is for sure, gigs that you actually booked. And another good rule of thumb for that document is to go ahead and um, put it down for the time of the month that that money is actually coming in. So for example, we currently use um, a company to process our credit cards where if someone pays us in October, any time in October, that money doesn't hit our business account until the beginning of November. So. Keep that in mind as you're writing down in each month how the money that's coming in. So what's great about doing this is you can take a quick glance at this Excel sheet or however you want to do it, but we'll give you access to our document. You can take a quick glance and see the months of plenty and the months of want. And what that does is when you have a month of plenty, you can go ahead and reserve that money and hold of it until, um, to cover you for the month of want. And you can also look ahead and see like, hmm, July is going to be really slow for us. We're not going to be bringing in a lot of money. So what are maybe product specials can we do or extra sessions we can book to help bring in money that month? So knowing where your money, the months that your money is coming in is the first step in having a regular income. Now next week we're going to talk about how to actually pay yourself with that irregular income. In the meantime, you can go to our blog and beneath this video you will see a link that you can download the sheet that we use to keep track of our yearly income. It's pretty self-explanatory and we have a little key on the side to explain um, some of the little notes that I put in there for myself so I can know a few different things. So if you have any questions, leave them below and um, we look forward to seeing you guys next week.